some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. Today's video takes us to Virginia, where we have a couple of anti-intellectual, anti-education, uh, soft-hard morons who are denying their child's right to have an education get provided to them, thus ensuring that their progeny is just as stupid as they are when he grows up. So, without further ado, let's just go ahead and get right into this S show, shall we? Are you Chris? A what? Are you Chris? You know y'all y'all are trespassing. We're not, sir. We got a reason to be here. For what's that? I'm gonna explain that to you and her. So these are permitted warrants, okay? Um under code eighteen point two dash three seventy one. While being eighteen years age or older, willfully contribute to <laughs> or cause any act of omission or condition which rendered a lion how do you pronounce your last name, man? I don't wanna mispronounce it. I you can pronounce it how you Tonight, want. Tonight, is that correct? What's what's the what's Yeah, what is it? I'm, I'm explaining that to you. Okay. A child under the age of 18, delinquent in need of services and need of supervision, abused or neglected, as defined in 16.1-228. Okay. That's what the warrant's for. So, what happened? Um, I didn't take this warrant out against you. So I don't know anything about the case. Who did? Kimberly Kendrick. This is this is through the public Country County Public mm. Schools has, oh. has issued this. We're just out here. Oh well, I don't have any contracts with That's them. I don't know. Uh... Right. Josh Timber <clears throat> and down the road. Yeah, it always comes down to contracts with these soft hearts, uh, as if the government is indeed a corporation. Yeah, soft heart, uh, you need to get your head out of your ass and figure out that the government is not a corporation, and there are laws out there to uh, help children out get their education that way they can at least have some future ahead of them and there are various options not just public schools but you do have uh, private schools you do have homeschooling you do have options but if you uh, don't want to educate your child then uh well uh you better have a good attorney to deal with that crap otherwise you're screwed yeah. So what are they? What I mean, I don't understand what's going on. Um, I could read you the criminal complaint. Would you like me to do that? Sure. Okay. So this one is yours. Okay. Holly Kerbo is the mother of minor child Elaine Knipe. Mm -hmm. Date of birth: 2-28-2017. Since February 2024, I've attempted through postal mail, phone calls, and home visits to address the education of Elaine with no success. As of today. 81224 24 line is not enrolled in school nor has homeschool documentation been received. And okay, I'm so they're wanting homeschool documentation? I believe so. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Okay. Well, that's not criminal. So. <laughs> well, that's why these are permitted. Yours, yeah. yours you know, is the same. It's just got your name in, in lieu of oh, her name. Well, I don't want it. I'm good. I mean, I'll take it. I'm not signing anything. Well, we, you don't have to sign anything. Oh, okay. Please. I mean, does he? No one has ever talked to us. I mean, well, I'm, it says in there that she's tried to make contact and, and wasn't. I mean, I'm here. reserving my common law rights protected by the Constitution of the United States. I have no contracts yeah, with them have, or this city. Or yeah, I have. I, they, that's my kid. God gave me that kid right there. So yeah, I've heard that same religious excuse from uh, people who didn't want to lose weight. If God had wanted me to lose weight, then he would have made me thin. Well, a counter to that is your body is quite capable of losing weight as long as you, uh, well, watch the calories. I mean, you don't need too much exercise, but you gotta watch the calories. And an argument can be made here is that if you want your child to be uh, competitive in the job market later in life, you better well uh, give him some education right now. Otherwise, well, he'll be just a... Uh, drag on the economy when he has to go on wel welfare because he can't uh, read or write. Hey, man, I, I completely okay. agree with okay. you. Okay, all right. You so. will have to sign saying that you did receive no. this. Oh, no, I'm not signing that. No. Absolutely not. No, I don't, I don't, I'm not signing any contracts with them. 
Okay. <laughs> so I want nothing from them. So this isn't the school this, system. Well, I'm not asking anyone for help. We don't need help. No, we're, no, this, we're good. This isn't saying anything, saying you're going to do anything with him in school. This is saying that we've gave you this paperwork and you have a court date. Oh. And then you can explain oh, that. Well, That's yeah, all I'm, it says. I'm it's not saying that, that you have to do anything with your son. I'm not saying okay. that. Okay. Yeah, I'm not signing nothing. So. Okay. So here's the other option. This is a permitted <laughs> warrant. Okay. I can give you a copy of this. I can set you a court date. You can willfully come appear at that court date. If you don't sign this and I don't serve this to you, the other option is you're placed under arrest. And, we'd have to take you and then we have to take you in. This is the simplest way to do it, the way oh, they've okay. done it. I would like to give you this paperwork, let you choose the court date that works out well for y'all's own schedule, and then appear. So they're, they're saying that you have to put your, is that what they're saying? This that you have to put your child in public school? And no, not in public school either public school or provide some kind of homeschool documentation to prove that he is receiving some type of education. You can okay. homeschool your kid okay. from however many age, uh, the age of whatever age. Yeah, that sounds pretty simple. All you got to do is provide proof that you're going to homeschool your child and then you can stack off as much as you can unless they come to your house and start uh, to test your child to make sure that... Uh, he has received the uh, proper education. If not, then I'm sure they can uh, go from there. But, uh, yeah, if you do properly educate your son, at least give him uh, proper reading and uh, math skills, maybe he'll accomplish something in life instead of being a uh, brainless uh, nut job for the rest of his life. But given how the uh, lead paint addled brains of soft tards work, I'm going to guess that this simple alternative is not going to be uh, holding up well with this uh, soft tards uh, way of thinking. Well, I'll let you know that you're trespassing. I guess if you want to kidnap us and kidnap our kids. Listen, man. Uh, I mean, I shit not, ain't going to be good. I do you not know. want to arrest you. I don't oh. want to because well, we I mean, you can't arrest me. I mean, all, if all you want to do is just I mean, I haven't committed any crimes, so I, understand I haven't committed have any no crimes. Crime so that. if you want to kidnap us, then I guess uh, that's what's going to happen. I'm not signing. Anything, I'm not signing shit. So I guess we're getting I haven't committed any crimes. I haven't committed any crimes. The chance might back. Over what crime? We haven't committed any crimes. I've explained to you. The refusing to take the warrants that we have and the option we gave you. What happens, if we, down, what happens if we take the warrants, sir? We're too far past that point now. We gave you that you, option. So what? Hey, I got to cut my shit off, man. I understand that. Dude, I got my generator running. We, we can't, you, you just can't just come here give and just trespass and fucking kidnap us. Give me your wow. hand, Wow, what the fuck? Give me your hand. Dude, what? Dude, hand. you're on my property in front of my kids. Give me your hand. You're in front of my kids, give me man. your hand. Just make this easy. Please Make it easy. Hand. You want to come kidnap me off my property? Chris, last Unexpected. Chance. Last chance. You, your you're hand. trespassing. Ah! 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 Give me your hand. Okay. Give me your hand. I'm over with you. You want Give me your hand. You can talk to yourself, Thank okay? you. Do you hear me? You want to come kidnap me off my property? Chris, last Unexpected. Chance. Last chance. You, Give me your you're hand. trespassing. Oh, oh We gave. Please. Give me your hand. Please. Sir. I'm gonna leave look you on handcuffs so you look can talk me. to your son, okay? Please look at me. Do you hear me? Look at me, please. Please. I'm gonna let you get your son. Please and then we'll don't hurt him. him. Please don't hurt him. I'm not trying. Please, we're just being okay. We we're homeschooling. Okay. Please. We tried to explain that to you, okay? Well, it's scary when someone comes to your I land. I understand. Okay. Please don't hurt him. I'm not going to hurt him. They have Go to. Ahead. They got to let you know who's boss. Go ahead and stand him up. Go ahead, 30. Seconds. I'll sign your paperwork. Sorry, lady, but uh, you're way past that at this moment. I mean, you had your chance to cooperate and, uh, well, at least uh, give the paperwork a chance and see if they could work around it as far as homeschooling goes. But you, yeah, just wanted to go the soft art route. You have to round and found out. You can bring two units for transport. Um, we have two to yes, We're just homeschooling our um, child, please. We don't even live here. We just own land here. Y'all trying to, like, intimidate us and fucking... Please. 
force us to sign shit. Sit him up. Inside, man. I'm gonna let you stand with your son right here, okay? Call him over here. And I'm gonna stand here with you till somebody gets here, okay? But you're not going inside the house. You understand? You understand? Okay, you can call his name, get him over here with you in the front of the car. The only reason that you're not in handcuffs right now is because your little boy is staying out here, okay? What have we done? We gave you the option. We, we don't have a choice. We have to serve these warrants. Well, it's, okay? it's frightening. We didn't expect anyone here. It's frightening. Ma'am, we did not approach you in a frightening manner. Anyone who comes to you telling you that you, you like, that you have you just, just been a criminal, you are a criminal. You just went from bringing paperwork to fucking violating my rights and attacking me. Would you wow. like to call your son over here? Yes, sir, officer so right Dylan. Would you like to call your son to stand with you over here? I'm begging you. We don't even live here. We just bought property here and we're fixing it I up. call just, on the name of Jesus, please. Please, Jesus, please be I'll with let us. You know you were trespassing. Now you came and assaulted me. If you want me to sign no something, I'll sign oh, it. Man, we're too late for that. Why is it too late? We're going to give you that option. And you refuse to take it. I, I told you what the consequences were. I've got it now. recorded. You've got it recorded. I told you what What's the your consequences were. Gilbert? Gilbert, yes, sir. I told you what the consequences were if you guys did not sign. I told you what if you could sign, what would I, happen? We're just, it's summertime. We are just, we're enjoying, <laughs> like, what are, we're not, he's not even supposed to be in school yet. <laughs> it's literally oh summertime. Ma'am. What are you hey, guys doing? Do you want to get your son over here to stand with you? They work for Satan. That's if you doing. continue to yell at me, you're going to be in handcuffs. Okay. Jesus. And I'm being very, very nice right now. Heavenly Father, please be with us. Please be with us. Heavenly Father, please shine your light. Well, show these officers. Show these officers. Well, I appreciate you assaulting me, coming on my land and assaulting a peaceful family. I will advise you, you do have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can will be used against you. Anything you want. You have the right to an attorney if you cannot afford an attorney. I've committed no crimes. Me. I don't need an attorney. Do you understand your I've rights? I've committed right zero. Yeah, yeah, I understand my rights. Do you understand my rights? Yes, sir. You don't seem to understand my rights. Uh, no, uh, soft heart. I don't think you seem to understand what your rights fully are, nor do you seem to understand that there are laws, especially when it, come, when it comes to the Constitution, that the Tenth Amendment does grant the states the rights to create laws that are not covered in the Constitution, and that means that states tend to protect children as well as adults. And if you uh, refuse to educate your children, that way they can have a uh, bright future ahead of them at the very least, then... Uh, well, you are essentially committing a crime at that point because children do have a right to an education, even if it's school homeschooling, uh, charter schools, private schools, or public schools. They still have a right to it, and you are apparently denying that right. God put me here. Not, not He didn't put me here with you over me. I agree with you. There is no victim. Let me if you sign the paperwork. The United States Constitution, no, the law, you would understand that you just assaulted a man that has never assaulted anyone in his life. I've committed zero crimes. What are you, a sheriff? Who are you? You're yes, sir. A sheriff. That's, that's sheriff. Yeah, you're supposed to uphold the Constitution. Yes, sir. But instead, you're you're upholding maritime law. You're, if no one has law. ever spoken to us. Why, why didn't someone just come and speak to us? Why does it have to be a crim... Like, there is no warning. A soft heart, you just said that they're upholding maritime law and commercial law. Uh, yeah, uh, that just shows you don't know jack squat about anything uh, at this point. So, uh, you definitely need to pull your head out of your ass and uh, figure out how the world really works because this... A uh, rather shitty viewpoint you've got. It just isn't uh, cutting it. For violating your oath. 
We had no part in this. You swore besides to uphold the United the States Constitution. Okay. You're here to protect the people, but you're here assaulting a man that's never committed any crimes in his whole life. I've never been arrested or, or committed any crimes my whole life, and you're here I'll assaulting leave. me in front of my family. I'm sure that's why that And my was son. Committed. Yeah. Why are you acting like this? What do you mean? Why would you come to someone's land, call them criminals, Good and job. then wonder why we don't want to accept your 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 Man, contracts? I, I never accused you or him of anything. He, he's violating the same. You said, "Do you want me to read market. your criminal the criminal the criminal the, complaint?" That's a complaint. Not a criminal. We haven't been. We, there is no criminal. We didn't. We've never we spoken to anymore. anyone. It's summertime. We, I don't even, I, I don't, I, I haven't spoken to anyone. I don't know how things work in Virginia. Uh, yeah, uh, ignorance is not exactly an excuse at this point, lady. Uh, the best thing you could probably have done was go to your school district and ask uh, questions. And if you chose the homeschooling option, they would have accommodated you by providing you with the proper information because education is key with children, and they would have done it. They would have said, okay, here's your uh, paperwork, and uh, just go see these people at this department, and they will take care of you. But no, you're too damn stupid to figure that out. I don't know. Would you like me to explain the process a little bit to you? Yes. Okay. So the criminal complaint is the name of the paperwork, okay? That's what it says at the top. Right? A criminal is someone that violates someone's rights. That's right. someone who's committed a crime. <laughs> Would you like me to explain it to you? Yes. I mean, okay. it's dumb. So the criminal complaint can be used for taking out warrants, taking out um, emergency custody orders, different things. What someone does when they're trying to apply for a warrant is they write a statement out on a criminal complaint. A criminal complaint then goes before a magistrate. The person who took out or is attempting to take out the warrant then has to explain to the magistrate their belief under oath of facts, okay? The magistrate then, if they find probable cause, they issue a warrant. In this case, a warrant, a permitted warrant was issued. Some warrants are not permitted, which means you get arrested. Some warrants are permitted, which means per officer discretion, you can be served and given a court date. That's why it's, that's the, the paperwork is called a criminal complaint. This, just because you're being arrested does not mean you're guilty of anything. That's why I said I'm not calling you guys criminals. Well, he's my son. This has nothing to do with her. This is my decision. I'm the man of this family. This is my decision. I'm choosing to homeschool. I do not want my son in that corrupt-ass fucking public school. If you people, want to arrest me for that, fine. A lot Let's of people do it. feel the same She way has way. nothing. She, you if can't they would have come to talk to us, if they would have ever have made contact, we would have known. We didn't know. Okay. We didn't know. If that's all, if that's all I have to do is show them that he's being homeschooled. Come on. No, they know better than to come on here and trust him. Come they on, them. please have a heart. We're not here back. doing anything wrong. We're here. look, he's building a cabin. Man, I'm not saying you are. We're teaching our son. Like well, you don't have to keep fucking. They they know what they're doing is wrong. Well, I just want to just please, right. Officer Gilbert. Yes, please, we didn't know. Now we do. That's fine. No, just stop begging. No, Let take stop. Me. Let him take me. It's fine. Elion, come on. It's fine. You're all he has. Come on, man. I haven't committed any crimes. They're we didn't crimes. know. They just committed a crime. We Not didn't us. know. Okay, well. They didn't they ever didn't talk know. to us. We They didn't. We didn't know. Now we do. He explained to you, if you refuse to sign the paperwork, the second option where you get to go in, to the jail. When you go into the jail, you're going to talk to the master. They're going to give you a court date, what me and this gentleman would have done while we were here and we would have left. You refused. Well, it's frightening. You, you guys showed so up. Section, you're talking about order. criminal charges. That's frightening. We don't know what to do with that. We're it's peaceful fine. people. Fine. Calm down. Calm down. Just let him fucking arrest. Let's go. He's Calm not down. a bad person. He's he's, he's a very oh, good man. Find out. I'm, I'm filing charges. I'm pressing charges. Like if I have to sign know, under duress, I'll let me sign. Charges. Please. Our son is like, he doesn't, ha he just has Stop. us. Stop. If they Please. don't release me, if they take me in, I am pressing charges. That'll be fine. You're okay. You're, you're trespassing you're gonna talk to the and you you're fucking, gonna, you're gonna court yeah, you assaulted me and you're kidnapping me and I'm pressing charges.
You have no authority over me. You think you do. And God's going to punish you for treating the people like this that you work for. God's going to punish you for this shit. Mark my words. Let us take it as a, as a for what it is. Two, four, five, seven, eight, nine, You're violating your own. Please have a oh. heart. Two, four, Please five, seven, eight, look at me. I'm looking at you. I would rather die of starvation than to rob the people that you rob and kidnap people. You're out. Every speeding ticket you give, every ticket you give the people, you're 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 robbing. Officer people. Gilbert, you're charging people under commercial law. That's a nice conspiracy theory you got right there. You got any proof for it? I mean, seriously, uh, soft hard. Uh, commercial law. I mean, are you talking about the UCC, which governs commercial transactions? This is not a commercial transaction. This is, well, in this case, child law regarding education. But, of course, looking at you and hearing what you're saying, I can tell that you are an anti-intellectual, anti-education moron, which I can understand now why you are a total sovtard. Please. Thirty-two to fourteen. I will. I will sign. Not, okay. Please, uh, ma'am. Okay. I, I explained it to you. And you said you weren't, and that, and we we placed you both under arrest. Could you respond to this location, please? They don't. Y you're not capable of changing your mind. Not after we have no, placed no, hands on you. We said you were under arrest. Yeah. Once they assault you, it, there ain't no turning back, man. Well, I'm just going to end the video right there because she continues to go in circles about this whole thing. But at any rate, the guy right here spends the next 16 days in uh, jail until he's bonded out. And uh, they believe somebody must have called CPS on them. Well, I'm afraid that uh, if somebody did call CPS on you, you might have already had contact with them at some point. Otherwise, it would have never gotten to this point. I mean, uh, the point of arresting you? Uh, yeah, at some point you're lying about this. And that's typical Sobtard and fraudulent behavior. Lie about it and make yourselves out to be the victims. Yeah, you're no victim here. Your son. Now, that's a different story. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you on the next one. This could be some groundbreaking stuff right here. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?